The visionaries and architects of India envisaged a vibrant, economically sound and highly industrialized future for the nation. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru championed the creation of public sector units, the temples of modern India, while Lal Bahadur Shastri spearheaded the need for self-sufficiency in agriculture and defense preparedness, particularly after the Indo-China War. Imagine the inside of a Jaguar, a MiG, or a Sukhoi fighter plane. The temperature of an operational turbo engine that propels the aircraft can touch incredibly high levels, as high as 1000 degrees Celsius. And that's not all. The interiors of the engine are subject to highly corrosive fuel combustion activity, along with severe mechanical stress. Ordinary metals and alloys would simply disintegrate under such conditions. The only material strong enough to endure such extreme conditions is super alloys. The country witnessed enormous growth across various high technology industries, especially in the strategic sectors like space, atomic energy, aeronautics, defense, power, and general engineering industries. Eminent scientists all over India had foreseen the critical need for indigenous availability of special metallic material, especially super alloy and special metals for the growth and development of these sectors. In the 70s, a modern and technologically advanced super alloys and special metals plant was set up in Hyderabad. Christened Mishradhatu Nigam Limited, popularly known as Midhani. Midhani is a Government of India enterprise under the Ministry of Defence Production, established with a mission to achieve self-reliance and ultimately self-sufficiency in this highly specialized materials field. An ISO 9001-2008 company, Midhani is set up with technical know-how acquired from global leaders in the Western and Eastern Bloc. Integrated operations at the plant were initiated in 1982 and commercial production commenced during July 1983. Since then, Midhani has gone well beyond the scope of the original product mix and developed more than 100 grades to cater to the needs of various strategic and commercial sectors. By evolving an in-depth understanding of processing, structure, performance, interrelationships, Midhani has contributed to meeting numerous technological challenges, including the manufacture of ultra-high strength steel, exceeding international standards along the way. Today, Midhani is the only plant in the world with completely integrated state-of-the-art facilities under one roof. And a talent pool of the most qualified human resources in this specialized domain. This technological advantage has resulted in significant savings in terms of valuable foreign exchange for India and has also put the country in the league of industrially advanced nations like USA, France, Germany, UK, the erstwhile USSR and Japan all of which have the requisite capabilities for manufacturing super alloys and special metals.
Let's take a closer look at the most advanced range of special metals and alloys manufactured by Midhani. Iron-based, cobalt-based and nickel-based super alloys for aeronautics, space, armaments, furnaces and power plants. Wonder metal titanium and titanium alloys for aeronautics, aerospace, atomic energy, defense, chemical and petrochemical, fertilizer, desalination plants and for medical applications like orthopedic implants and custom-made prosthesis. Special purpose high-strength steels such as precipitation hardening, austenitic, ferretic, duplex and martensitic. The applications for these materials include cryogenics, armaments, nuclear and space. In particular, for PSLV, GSLV, Chandrayaan, Moon Impact Probe and Human in Space programs. Controlled expansion alloys for making thermostats used in geysers, radar cones and refrigerators and for glass to metal or glass to ceramic sealing. Soft magnetic alloys with extensive applications in electrical, electronic and telecommunications equipment as cores and laminations, in particular the manufacture of transformers, inductors, amplifiers, oscillators, switching circuits in communication devices and measuring instruments. Electrical resistance alloys used as heating elements for furnace industries. Ultra pure iron. Soft iron with carbon content as low as 0.007% used for signal relays in railways and for strategic defense applications. Molybdenum products for lead wires and support wires of incandescent bulbs and lamps used as heating elements and reflectors in high temperature vacuum furnaces, shrouds and boats for sintering nuclear fuel and for spray metallizing of gearbox components in automotive industries. The list also includes a host of other specially manufactured products possessing various attributes customized to suit customer specific requirements. The infrastructure at Midhani consists of the best in class equipment, systems and processes. This includes specialized furnaces backed by a computer controlled monitoring system geared to handle primary melting, remelting and refining activity under vacuum and electro slag conditions along with specialized arc furnaces for primary melting of special materials. Let us now proceed on a quick tour of this state-of-the-art facility. As I have been mentioning about indigenization of uh, alloys and products and also equipments, 
The one standing in front of us is ESR, Electro Slag Refining Furnace, which is being used for refining of steels, super alloys, and other special alloys being used in the strategic sectors. This not only saved a lot of foreign exchange, but also we are proud to make such a critical equipment. That is concept, fabrication, manufacturing, and commissioning to the final extent, and it's standing in front of us. The extensive quality assurance systems at Midhani include certifications by authorities like Director General of Aeronautical Quality Assurance, Director General of Civil Aviation, Self-Certification Status bestowed by Director General of Quality Assurance, DGQA, for Armament Materials, Department of Space, and Department of Atomic Energy. Beyond approvals, beyond certifications, Medhani has also gathered several accolades for its immense contribution towards making India self-reliant in super alloys and special metals. A name that stands for strength, strong materials, the strongest steel, super strong super alloys, and a stronger self-reliant India. Midhani.